y'all. Ignore my appearance. I look crazy. I got rained on today. Blah. But we are back from Georgia. You guys know we went to Georgia for a funeral, um, and we got back late yesterday evening. Um, we had to go do some things at the investment property when we got back and check on some things. And, oh, my God, you guys, I look horrible. I'm so sorry. Um, go to Home Depot, get some more stuff. So, that was last night. Today, we went to um, Ronnie's niece's birthday party, Skylar's birthday party. She turned eight while we were in Georgia, and her party was today. So we went to Sky Zone, and baby girl loved it. So I do have some footage of that. If I remember, I'll put it in. Let me show you guys. I purchased this beautiful Starbucks cup today in Target. So pretty. Look at this. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Um, they also had a purple and pink one, um, but I just thought this color was like screaming summer. Now these are the large size, so they were $20, but I, ha I got like $8 off, so um, I ended up only paying 12. And then I finally read up on my The Lip Bars Prom Queen. So pretty. Um, Felicia was wearing this in one of her videos, Miss Fee Marie. And um, I asked her what color it was. And I had this color when it first came out. Someone stole my purse last fall. And this was in there. And I never replaced it. And they were always sold out whenever I went into Walmart or Target to get it. And so I just gave up. But I remembered that if you order something on the Target app and it says it's in stock for store pickup, but you know it's really not, go ahead and order it because they're going to tell you in about an hour or so um, when they try to fulfill the pickup order that, oh, it's out of stock. Our apologies. We actually don't have it in stock, but we'll ship it to you for free. And I like that option because a lot of times I'm not willing to order stuff like this online because the shipping is almost just as much as the product. But if I order it through the app and you guys realize that you really don't have it, then you offer to ship it to me for free. So I get free shipping. So anyway, they shipped this and that came in while we were in Georgia. So I'm going to go ahead and flip the camera around and show you guys the things that we got for the investment property to kind of like do the finishing touches. And I'll show you also the exterior colors that I'm thinking about having the contractors paint the property. Okay. Hey y'all. Happy. Tuesday today is August 2nd my baby girl's second birthday is tomorrow and I told Instagram last night but I didn't tell you guys that I went ahead and jumped out there and said she could have a last minute pizza slash dessert party at daycare because I wasn't able to invite all of the daycare kids to her party on Saturday because she has so many cousins that I already filled up like 20 some slots of kids so I just jumped out there made a flyer and sent it out to all of the daycare um you know, parents, because I'm the class mom, so I have all their information. And then I was like, oh crap, I have nothing. So I ran downstairs and I had like so many different cute um, party decor from like the Target Dollar Spots ice cream shop theme that they had a couple years back. So that's going to help me out. And then my sister threw my niece Brooklyn a second birthday party last year and it was the too sweet theme. So she had this banner left over or this backdrop. I'm going to take that to the wall. She had these letters right here. It's going to look so cute on her table. She had a few of these banners with the pom-poms on them, so I'll probably use those around the room. She had party hats left over. It's only eight kids anyway, so that's more than enough. She, I had some of these, but she actually has more than eight for the kids to make their Sundays in, so I can use these. Um, she also had this table decor left over, ice cream truck, so I'm going to use that. Um, I found these ice cream plates at the Dollar Tree this morning, so they can put like their um, cupcake on that. And then I found these a while back at the Dollar Tree. They're napkins, so they match the theme. My sister had like some wall cutouts of donuts and stuff, so I'm gonna put that up. I showed um, Instagram this last night. I had this from the Target Dollar Spots um, ice cream collection. It does light up, let me show you guys. Me and Ray put a battery in it last night, and it's so cute, it lights up. Um, like orange on the bottom and green on the top. So cute. So I put that on one of her tables. Um, while I was in Dollar Tree, I got her a crown to wear tomorrow and also a birthday sash. Also got two um, cupcake like um, table center pieces. 
And I got a ton of toppings for their ice cream sundaes. Um, you guys, I got Oreo cookies to smash up. We got these little crunch pieces. I got go, um, gummy bears. I got sour worms. I got um, Sour Patch Kids. I got M&M's, Reese's Pieces, all of that stuff. I got tons of candles. Um, I got some balloons and some string. I'm not sure that I'm going to use them. And then my sister had just purchased um, some of the the party stuff for my niece Peyton's first birthday that's gonna be at the end of this month. And she purchased like 40 gift bags because they came in packs of 20 and she only needed 24. So that's why she had to get two packs. So she gave me eight of them and they just so happened to be in the pastel colors. So I packed them with stuff that I bought from Dollar Tree like candy, ring pops, um, little blowers. I put bubbles in there. They also have like Play-Doh. I put lollipops in there. They have fun dips. And then I also put um, some tattoos in there. So that's good enough for them. Um, and then, yeah, um, my friends are going to come over on Thursday night to help me pack up all of the favorite cups for her actual party on Saturday because I have a ton of stuff for that as well um and then what else I printed off the labels I went when I went to my mom's house because my color printer is not hooked up this is that other backdrop I'm not going to use that one but my color printer here is not hooked up so while I was at uh -oh, while I was at my mom's house I went ahead and printed out the labels for her hold on for her um her favorite cups for Saturday's party. And they came out so cute, you guys. Let me show you. Look at them. So these are the Minnie Mouse ones for the girls. And they just say, thank you for celebrating with me. Love, Reagan. And then the boys are the Mickey Mouse. I ordered these from Etsy and then just printed them on white cardstock paper. So I'm gonna put these in the back room where all her other stuff is for her party on Saturday because I've been trying to keep it separate. Um, when I pick her up today, I'm going to, well, before I pick her up today, I'm going to grab the cupcakes and yeah, probably just the cupcakes because I'm going to have to, well, I can probably grab those tomorrow when I grab the ice cream because we don't have freezer space, you guys. So I got to get the ice cream tomorrow, but these are going to be the favorite things. I'm just going to use one of these hole punchers that I bought from Amazon to punch a hole at the top. And then this is the clear paper I'm going to wrap the cups in. Hopefully it's long enough. I, I thought it was going to be longer, but whatever. These are the cups for the girls, which I may have to get another one. And these are the cups for some more girls. And then um, this is all the stuff for the girls. The headbands, the sunglasses. I got them rings. I got them lip gloss. The little um, coloring packs. This is her ears she's going to wear on Saturday at the party. The girls also have bubbles, the Minnie Mouse bubbles. And then these are the um cupcake picks only doing cupcakes because you guys ronnie and i are headed out of town on our vacation slash baby moon slash birthday trip the very next morning and i'm just trying to be done with this so two parties and having to pack for an international week-long trip is a lot and then this is the little boy stuff i got them the mickey mouse cups they have the party hats they have some pullback cars just this mega uh, Minnie mouse favor pack that i can split up they have um, sunglasses bubbles and then the coloring play packs that's what's going in there and then this is all of the tableware the plates and everything the tablecloth all that stuff is in that bag to take to the party um the party people called me yesterday to confirm everything they did tell me that i can bring a veggie tray and a fruit tray if i wanted to and also i can bring a box of the individually individually um wrapped potato chips um so I may grab some of those as well for Saturday. And then you guys, that's it. That's her two parties. I'm done. I'm tired. That's what's going to happen. So I'm going to box all this stuff up tonight. Well, probably this afternoon. Drop some of it off today when I um, go to pick Ray up. And then I'll bring the rest tomorrow. And y'all, that's it. That's all. Okay? So I'm going to go finish doing some work. And then I will catch you guys later.
Happy birthday, dear Reagan. Happy birthday to you. How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? Say two. Two. Say two, Reagan. Right. May God bless you. May God bless you. May God bless you. May God bless you. Yay! Blow it up, Ray. Blow it harder. Blow hard. No, don't touch it. Blow it hard, Ray. Stop. Ray, okay, open it. Which one you want? The race cousins came over there. Wish her happy birthday. Ray, open your gift. <gasps> open it, Ray. What is it? Oh my goodness! You can carry that one around the house. That's so nice, Reagan. Is it a dollhouse? Say thank you. This one she can carry you around the house. Can I open all your baggage? Okay, Ray, go get another one. Hold on, wait, give her, give her, give her this one. Yeah, that one she can um, move around the house. Yeah, This one is going to be heavy, so it's stationary. You got to put it together. Why don't you put it together? He should be able to lift it one time, but that's about it. Hey, hey, it's not as before. It's fine. Open it, Ray. She may need a little bit of help, Sky. Ooh, what is it? Oh, say thank you. That's from Sky Sky. Oh, Sky Sky got you that, Mama. You say thank you. Ooh, that's for your dollhouse. So we can need to open up these. Okay. So there's two more left. Wow, Ray. You gonna put your dollhouse together? Daddy's over here putting together the big kahuna that Auntie got her a uh, kid craft um, dollhouse for her room. Now she ne now she never coming out her room. Once we put this together. Ooh, what's in there? What was the other gift y'all opened? For the dollhouse? Oh, okay. Okay, for the dollhouse. It says, some days are just I love you. Love you, Ray. Love you, Ray. You can order some more Hope if it doesn't. One. Sometimes it does come with a, a few to. things. Ray. Okay. Ray, look. Here's a gift. 
There's Minnie Mouse. Look, right here. Oh, Santa. Santa. Oh, you still could be Santa. Look, huh? Here, take it. Look, there's some more. Wait, Minnie, you know what I got? I got a leash. No. What do you mean, no? Megan. You still got yours? Megan. Yeah, I can use mine. Megan. Megan. Daddy just finished putting together her big dollhouse that Auntie bought her for her birthday. And it also has a porch swing. Isn't that so cute? It came with this canopy bed. It came with a lot of the furniture. And a lot of the furniture is wooden, so that's good. It came with the, the tub and the sofa down there and stuff. So really, really cute. Has two porch areas, and then this is the nursery up here. She can't even reach the nursery because this thing is so tall. It's four stories big. But we're going to put this in her room and take the glider out and put it in the baby's room. And then they also bought her this um, plastic dollhouse that closes up, and she can bring that around the house and play with it. So that's really cute, too. So, yeah, she's enjoying her cousins. Molly Mark came over straight off the plane from Mexico to see her on her birthday. So cute. All right, y'all, so we moved the glider out of her room. We got it back on the floor right there. So she can fit her new dollhouse in here. And then we put the glider in baby boy's nursery room, which we haven't finished getting together. But this is a really nice dollhouse. She really loves it. And um, the rest of these are like mixed in with toys, but it's food for her kitchen set that's right here. So we're gonna go through this, separate all the food from the other toys and then take the other toys out of here so she can just have her stuffed animals her um dollhouse and then her kitchen set here so that's what we're going to do eventually but for tonight tonight's task was to put the glider in baby boy's room and bring this up here we had to take the glider back and sides arms off in order for it to fit but ronnie put them back on so it's good to go now so yeah hey y'all hey happy Thursday. Today's Thursday, August the 4th. Um, I just wrote on this money, on the back of this money, um, when we went to Georgia for the funeral, um, Ronnie's grandmother gave Ray two $5 bills. So I'm going to go put it in her piggy bank. Um, but I wrote from Grandma Pound on it just because, you know, it's sentimental money. And when she gets older, you know, if she doesn't remember Grandma Pound or something, then that's a memory for her to have. Um, and I showed you guys last night that we went ahead and we made a change in her room. Finally, um, while Ronnie had the energy, he went ahead and took out the glider. I think I showed you guys this last night and he put it in here. It's not going to stay right there. It'll probably likely go over in that corner. But for right now, we just left it anywhere. I still need to putty the holes for where the old um, curtain rod was. I did buy the spackle, which is right here. So I need to do that. Um, and I also need to prime this back wall with the stripes on it so I can put the removable wallpaper up. But right now, I'm going to fold up this money and put it in her piggy bank. We cleaned her room last night and Ray has been in here this morning. Whenever she cooks in her kitchen, she has to dump out all of the food. It never fails. So she'll have to clean that up when she gets home. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and put this uh, money in her piggy bank. Skylar also came up here and um, put $5 in here yesterday for her, for her birthday. So I'm putting all her money in there. So that's good and then um i see she got into her stuffed animals as well and her dolls they were in her canopy over there for right now i just put the ottoman that we used for the glider i put it under here because it's pink i'm gonna have to get baby boy a different one um that will match the tones of his room but yeah that's what's happening right now also ronnie ordered me some weather tech car mats for my truck because he's tired of getting in my truck and <laughs> my um, floor looking crazy. So those were just delivered. So I'm gonna pull that in the house. And it looks like my next door neighbor is getting a deck built because I see the workers um, unloading all their materials. Hold on, you guys. Oh, this is a big box, y'all. Hold on. All right, you guys. So this is the 
box there. Hopefully you guys can't see my address, but that's the weather tech box there. So Ronnie will deal with those and put those in the truck whenever he gets ready to, I guess he'll have to wash the truck or get it washed or something. This is also baby girl's <laughs> birthday gift, which is that wooden outdoor playhouse that we bought. It's really, really amazing. I hope it's all the pieces in here because this is how it was delivered, looking crazy. But we haven't gotten around to putting it together and we probably won't have time to do it until we get back in town because we're leaving on Sunday. Also, um, Harper, you guys have been asking about Harper. Harper hit me up. Her birthday was last week, I believe. Yeah, last week. So she sent me the links to what she wanted. She said she needed a new Ken doll. So I bought her this African-American Ken doll. There's only a couple bucks on Amazon. So I bought that. And then she sent me the link to this OMG um, LOL doll. She said she has a ton of LOL dolls, but she said they're missing the legs or the heads or something. She took them off. I don't know. So she sent me that link. I think that one came from Target and this one came from Amazon, the Royal B one. So I purchased these. I just need to put them in a um, birthday gift bag for you guys. I mean, for her, because she's going to come over this evening to see Ray for her birthday, but also pick up her birthday gifts. And then um, besides that, I had already planned for Brittany and Ebony to come over tonight to help me pack up all the favor cups for baby girl's birthday party, which is going to be on Saturday. I think I showed you that I had separated all the boys and girls stuff. So it's all here. Um, so they're just going to bring Harper's gifts as well in exchange with her while everyone is here this evening. Um, my cousin Courtney was here yesterday. They just got back from Mexico, her and Marley. And um, that's my cousin who watches and stays at our house when we are out of town. So she was here fresh off the plane when she got back from Mexico telling us about her trip and everything, her and Marley. And she helped me out yesterday by taking out all of Ray's braids and beads, the cornrows and, and beads last night. So that's good. I can wash her hair tonight or Ronnie can wash her hair, one of us. And then Ebony's going to come back tomorrow night, which is Friday, and give her individual braids and put some beads at the end so that my parents don't have to worry about her hair the week that we're gone. So then on my plate, I need to wash and blow dry my hair and go get some type of braids. I think I'm going to get some feed-in corn rolls, something quick, because I don't have the patience right now to sit for a long time. I really wanted knotless box braids, but I think I may wait to get those um, closer to my delivery date. And I have some travel coming up, obviously, this um, next week. And then in a few weeks after that, I'll be going somewhere in September for Labor Day and then also in the beginning of October as well. So I may just get um, the knotless box braids closer to those trips because I ain't got time right now. Let me see if I can show you guys what the workers are doing next door and we really want to extend our patio or extend our deck and get a patio built as well so depending on how they do with her house i may walk over there um and talk to them one day but can you see them putting down the materials it looks like she's getting a deck because those are huge like deck posts and stuff and i was sitting in my driveway eating my mcdonald's don't judge me watching youtube when i first pulled up and they like waved to me and you know how workers some like sometimes they're really really friendly because that's how they get their next job like just a referral so we'll see these are all ray's um cards she got from her cousins and her auntie yesterday um and she got a new book from her cousin leah too so we'll have to read this um but yeah maybe i'll just put harper's gift in this bag right here boop yep because this was what they put ray's gifts in but yeah so that's what's going on right now um <clears throat> the party place called and confirmed everything for the party on saturday so we're good to go there like i said we're just going to pack up the um favor bags and we're good to go did they write on this i hate when people write on these I just rip them off and reuse the bag anyway, but they didn't write on it, so that's good. Hopefully this will fit. Let's see if it does. Oh yeah, we're in business, y'all. Both of them fit. Now I don't think Ken is gonna fit, right? He gonna act up. He's gonna be the one to act up and not fit. This is crazy. Hold on, y'all. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna put some paper at the top of this and this is what we're going to rock with. Ken wouldn't push all the way down, but it's fine. She doesn't care. Harper won't care. So I'm going to go ahead and give this to Harper tonight. 
that'll be done um so yeah that's it that's all you guys don't mind this they also bought baby girl a dollhouse here this came from walmart as well but this is so that she can take it around the house with her it's like a little case and you put the pieces in and lock the side right here as you can see so this is for her to play with like on all levels of the house but her stationary one is upstairs in her room the large one and it's so cute so these are all the pieces and extra pieces they bought her to go with this and when you press so apparently the garage door opens so that you can drive the car in there so cute but on the front of the house if you press this button the lights come on and it has a doorbell that's so cute you guys so that's from walmart um we also have a couple more things so ronnie and i are just going to get her a lot of like winter and fall clothes for her birthday as well and then we are going to eventually put together that outdoor house for her too this is stuff is trash um so yeah that's what's happening she also got some stickers yesterday from her cousin which were on my floor so ronnie took them from her these are mcdonald's toys she gets those all the time um so yeah that's what's happening ignore the mess over there i bought us when i was in dollar tree some hand sanitizer to take on our trip with us so i can put this in my purse and also in my beach bag so I'll pack that and then I need to remember to pack um, my prenatals because I have two jars because when we went to Georgia I forgot to pack them and had to buy these in Georgia so I'm gonna put one of these in my suitcase and this as well put it on the steps do you guys gather stuff on the steps for when you go upstairs I do it all the time anyway um, that's what's going on you guys the party that she had at school the um ice cream party slash pizza party and everything for her birthday was amazing um she had a ton of fun so i'm glad that we were able to reuse all that party stuff i need to get it out of my trunk um and then like i said her um party place hyper kids called to confirm my order for her birthday party this saturday and i had ordered a pinwheel sandwich platter for the adults as well and they told me to bring my own condiments for that so i'm just gonna do ranch and yellow mustard i didn't see a really small mayonnaise so it's okay they can either put ranch on it or they can put mustard on it so i'm leaving this down here to just throw um in a bag to take with us and then i got her this card from dollar tree from me and ronnie and i also have like a little baseball set a little take little text baseball set that i brought like a year ago but she's finally able um to use it in the correct age so i think i'm gonna give her that for her birthday as well but like i said her main gift from us was the birthday party and or both birthday parties and then that um outdoor wooden house that we need to put together for her before the weather breaks hopefully um so yeah but yeah that's all that's going on right now guys i'm gonna do some more work and then like i said my friends will come over i'll get some um footage or time lapse footage of us packing up the favor cups for tonight um and that's it y'all so talk to y'all later Hey y'all, hey, it is still Thursday, August the 4th. I am leaving to go get baby love from daycare. Y'all know I leave at the very last minute. So it is 8, 4, no, it is 5, 46. I have to be there at six o'clock, but it's down the street. But anyway, I'm going to go pick her up from daycare and then I'll probably pop into Dollar Tree just to see um, if they have like, I don't know, get some, candy or something to put in the kids things i don't know um i'll get like i have ring pops so i may just get i don't know a bag of i don't know whatever kind of candy to put in there or maybe some fruit snacks like ring pops and fruit snacks that's a, that's, that's probably good right <laughs> i don't know anyway um maybe i should go to the grocery store and get those so i'll probably pop into a store after I get her and then Harp and Stace are supposed to be coming over so that Harp can pick up her birthday gift because her birthday was last week um, and yeah I showed you guys her gifts and they're gonna drop off Ray's Christmas gifts because we haven't seen I've seen Harp since Christmas but I haven't seen Stacy so and her gift was in Stacy's trunk so there's that and then Stacy not Stacy um Brittany and Ebony are coming over later as well to help pack up the favor 
um, cups for Ray's, what do you call it, birthday party <laughs> on Saturday. So there's that. Ronnie just got home, so he's kind of like chilling out. Um, I was able to wash and blow dry my hair, so I have to get it braided at some point tomorrow. I have no idea what style or how I'm going to get it, but I'm going to end up getting some feed-ins because I need it to be quick and I need it to be cheap and I need it, you know, to be done. And then Ronnie wants to go get our, um, well, me get my nails done, him get his feet done because my feet are pretty much already done um, tomorrow. But I don't know if I'm going to have time for that because I also have my anatomy scan doctor's appointment tomorrow morning i still have to work um and then ebony's coming back over tomorrow evening to braid um ray's hair which ronnie is supposed to be giving her a bath tonight and washing her hair and like detangling it and everything for me um so then she'll be good to go come saturday because i've already pretty much packed ray um just a recap we are ronnie and i are going on um a vacation a week-long vacation starting early sunday morning the day after her party so the night after her party or the the night of her party she's going to go home to my parents house or we'll drop her off at my parents house um for the the week so i need her hair to be done for um her birthday party but also for the week so that my parents won't have to deal with it um and then i have to pack her bag obviously for a week because she won't be at our house um for a week so i have already semi packed her bag and then i did her laundry so i'm just going to go through her laundry um make sure there's nothing else i want to put in her bag and then that'll be it she only needs one more outfit for this week for daycare which is tomorrow and then our shirts came in that we're going to wear on saturday to her party i'm just going to let her wear some black leggings with it mama's going to wear some black leggings and we're going to call it a day um what else Ronnie's shirt is black so he'll probably wear jeans with his or whatever but yeah that's what's going on with that and then yeah I don't know I don't know what else I think that's pretty much it you guys I know Ronnie has to do a little bit of laundry he hasn't packed anything but he's only got to worry pretty much about himself so he'll be fine to pack um I'm not going I'm going to challenge myself not to bring my largest suitcase this time um so yeah and our bag weight limit is only 40 pounds um so it ain't like i can pack a lot of stuff and then the bigger suitcase weighs more anyway so yeah um i've already booked our transportation from the um, hotel to the resort and also from the resort back to the hotel round trip so i booked that i paid for our bags the only last thing i have to do is when i check in for our flights when we're leaving the resort to come back home i do need to add our bags um for for you know that trip back home but other than that that's it and we are good to go with everything <laughs> i did want to go get a wax but i don't know if i'm gonna have time to do that i, I already know i'm not gonna have time to do that so i'm gonna have to use oh faithful um and what else that's about it you guys um we are going to the Cancun slash Revere Maya area. Oh my goodness, I need some lotion on. Revere Maya area. Um, we are going to uh, one of my favorite resort chains, Secrets. And we're staying at the Maroma Beach um, location, which is their number two location, apparently. We've already stayed at their number one location, which is the Akuma um, location. We love that one. We love Secrets, period. You guys have been on vacations with us plenty of times, and we love Secrets. It is adults only, so this is our vacation slash baby moon slash both of our birthday trips combined because i'm not going to be able to travel in november for my birthday because I, it'll, i'll be too close to birth giving birth so yeah y'all that's basically what's going on um we are both really excited and looking forward to the break that's all i can say we love baby girl so much and you know we're grateful for our jobs and everything but we need this break <laughs> um this investment property is like we're at like the 90 percent um completion uh finish line and it has been a headache it has been a lot of work it has been stressful it has been a lot so we are very deserving of this break and this vacation so i just cannot believe that we're gonna have i think it's six days or six and a half days of just uninterrupted couple time relaxation time just it's going to be amazing we can sleep in if we want we can stay out late if we want we can <laughs> just do whatever we want to do for those days and i just cannot 
Wait, we don't have to cook for those days. We don't have to drive anywhere. We don't have to change any diapers. We don't have to do any drop-offs. We don't have to do any pickups. We don't have to do any of that. No cleaning, nothing. So, um, yeah, I'm excited. Excited about that. But anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. I'm about to get big. I did okay? Yeah. Sweet. Perfect. Oh, Courtney did such a good job with um, Lauren's baby, Forrest's baby. Um, your cousin. I said, what she do? Oh, she made it the cake. She, she made, made the cake. She, you, you she swung the in spring? at the last mm -hmm. minute, too. Well, you said, Why are you laughing? I thought you were going to say, you going to eat some more? No, <laughs> you said, Hey y'all, hey, happy Friday. Today's August 5th and I am vacation ready. Y'all look at my nails. Can y'all see them? They're so pretty. I followed this nail um, salon on Instagram and I screenshotted um, something that they posted. It was very similar. So this is the first time that I'm trying the like stiletto shape only for vacation, but I told her don't do them too long and kind of round off the tips just a little bit. Not quite almond, but kind of. So yeah, they look really cute. And then I got my toes, this um, bright electric yellow green neon color as well. And then I just left the braiding salon. I got some feed in braids and I'll just put them in a bun um, when I get into the pool and stuff. But yeah, y'all. Yeah, I thought that each braid was $10. Am I tripping or was that just a long time ago? Cause this was $100 and she did, well maybe she did eight braids. Um, the, the, the design, I mean the picture that I showed her, the inspiration only had seven, but I know that I have a lot of hair and my hair is thick. So uh -oh. maybe she had to do eight, but still like that would be $80, not a hundred. But anyway, maybe they went up on their pricing. I don't know. Um, yeah. So anyway, I'm about to pick up um, my little cousin Marley, Courtney's son, because she's going to go out to dinner tonight. And then I'm going to head um, to go pick up Ray, who is with my friend Ebony, because she is braiding her hair and like some individual braids and going to put some beads on it. So yeah, that's what's happening. Um, I may, Ebony lives right next door, basically to the faux place that we like. So I'm thinking about, um, getting, um, some faux for dinner tonight. Ray, I mean, Ronnie said he fed Ray when he first picked her up. So she should be good to go. And, um, yeah, I'll pick up me and Ebony some faux. I think little man probably has eaten as well. If not, uh, grab him something quick and then once ebony finishes her hair we'll be heading back home you guys so that was the last thing that i needed to do i got my eyebrows done got my nails done i wasn't gonna get my feet done but ronnie was like yeah get them done like we're going on vacation go ahead go all out and homeboy got himself a manicure today as well <laughs> he cracks me up but anyway <laughs> um yeah he got himself a manicure and you know his normal pedicure that he gets before vacation before vacation only i told him he needs to go every two weeks okay anyway we did that um i had my um anatomy scan this morning baby boy looks great they said he is one pound now and that like all of his extremities and everything look good we're in the clear and they told me you know, I'll come back for a regular appointment in four weeks. And then four weeks after that appointment, I'll do my glucose test. And I'm 21 weeks now. Um, so time is flying. I'm more than halfway through. So that's good as well. Um, what else? Got my hair done. I got my nails done. Got my feet done. Ray's hair was washed this morning. Ronnie gave her a bath and washed her hair. And then I just gave her two straight back corn rolls so it wouldn't get, you know, dried out or, um, you know matted up or anything at daycare she's getting her hair braided i've already pretty much packed her i just need to do a once over on her bag one more time um and throw in like last minute items and like her toiletries that she uses every day and then i need to actually pack myself which most of my stuff i bought purchased new from shein.com because i can't fit any of my regular clothes now i'm five months pregnant so my stomach is out there out there so I did order um, quite a few pieces for this trip from Shein.com and I placed them right beside the suitcase. I just need to add them into the suitcase. Um, Ronnie was packing before I left to go get my hair done. So hopefully he's, you know, 90% packed as well. 
tomorrow is birthday party day um the party starts at three um and the only thing i need to do is purchase the cupcakes i may get a veggie and fruit platter and then um that's about it that's all i need to grab for the party um ronnie has to get his hair cut tomorrow morning so i'll probably be with um reagan and my little cousin marley until he gets back and then that's it we'll stop at wegmans on the way i'll grab the stuff and then we're headed to the birthday party after the birthday party <laughs> you guys we're gonna go straight to my parents house so she can open up her gifts and i'm already gonna have her suitcase and everything in the trunk because we'll be leaving her tomorrow evening with my parents for the week because our flight is on sunday morning bright and early so it doesn't make any sense for us to drop her off at like three o'clock in the morning we might as well just let her stay you know and go to sleep at regular time so that is what's happening you guys um i'm so ready for this vacation i'm telling you i'm so ready for this vacation i just want to unwind relax unplug um eat good sleep good swim not really swim but like <laughs> be at the pool be cute at the pool and just relax like that's what i want to do so I had a lot of stuff to do um, today. I actually stopped by the um, investment property and they were painting the exterior of the house, which is very exciting. Um, oh, I think I went the wrong way. Why did I do this? Anyway, um, which is very exciting. So I'm glad that we stopped by when we did because they were actually painting the entire house the same color and we didn't want that. We wanted a section of the front porch a lighter color and that was not relayed to the painters so we're glad that we got there when we did because we stopped them and told them hey you know fix this this is supposed to be this color or whatever so anyway um ronnie says he may stop by a little later we had the countertop company come in today and take measurements for the countertops um and the sink was also delivered this afternoon so ronnie threw it in the back of my truck hopefully we'll either drop that off tonight or in the morning tomorrow sometime um because he wants to see the house painted um and it of course it poured down raining today so i don't know how that affects like the paint job on the outside of the house but it's like yeah what can you do i don't know anyway um so that's like an update of everything that's going on we are pretty much like 95 percent done with the house now um they just need to like hang the last two light fixtures basically put all the light bulbs um make sure all the fixtures have um, light bulbs in them and then um, I think the countertops can go in Monday or Tuesday we'll be out of town but they can be going I did have to um, order the last three cabinets from Home Depot because they just didn't have the sizes in stock so those will be here next week as well and those can go in the kitchen will be complete all of the other cabinets have been installed the cabinet hardware has been installed the appliances have been installed they look great I'm really excited about those um, what else I don't know what else you guys I really don't I, I I think that's pretty much it um I think that's the update that needs to happen I need to finish packing tonight Ray's hair is going to be done and thank god for my village you guys they came over and helped me pack up all of her favors I got some footage of that so you guys probably have seen what the favors kind of look like from the outside of the cups um but just thank you so much to my village like i'm learning to accept the help when i need it and i knew this weekend was going to be jam-packed with stuff because of the party and because we're leaving the next day and my village stepped up and showed out and i'm just so grateful to have them <laughs> i.e they my cousin came over and took out ray's hair for me so i didn't have to worry about that and then you know Ebony is braiding it for me so i mean i'm just grateful you guys it, i get you a village that's all i can say get you a village but anyway and of course i would do the same for them um but anyway i'm here to pick up my um a little cousin so i'm gonna grab him and then head on to um down the road to get ray i know she's not finished with her hair yet she's probably just starting maybe like 15 minutes ago so we'll probably be there for a while which is why i'm gonna indulge in some food tonight but anyway i'll talk to you guys later deuces and probably well i'll probably vlog a little bit of her party and then next time y'all see me i'll be in mexico okay deuces good morning guys happy saturday today is august the 6th um it is birthday party day official birthday party day for baby girl 
Um, it's like 8.45, I think. Ronnie is leaving to go get his hair cut because he has to go a little bit further. His barber's on vacation, so he's going to a different barber that's a little further out. Um, <clears throat> Ronnie cleaned up baby girl's room. <laughs> he's He is determined to get all her toys in here and get them out of our room, but she still brings them in whenever she wants. But anyway, um, my friend Ebony braided her hair last night because as you can see, I went to go get mine braided for vacation because we are leaving at like, <clears throat> excuse me, <clears throat> we're leaving for mexico ronnie and i um probably leave here around five our flight is at eight a.m so baby girl's gonna go with my parents right after the party today so i'm grabbing her shoes let me see these may be a little big on her Oh, I wanted to show you guys that we went to DSW yesterday. They had a really good sale, so we grabbed Baby Girl her next size Crocs. Aren't these so pretty? Now, these were $30, and that was including the 25% off. But it's okay. Her daddy got them for her. And then Ronnie got some um, fresh Croc slides, and then I ordered mine. So mine won't be here till Monday. So I'm not taking them on vacation, but it's fine. I have plenty of slides. But mine were buy one, get one free. So I got two pair of slides for... What ended up being $16 because I had a $10 credit for or $10 reward coupon for DSW. And then by the time I made that purchase, they gave me a $5 reward for DSW. So I had $5. I would have used it on these, um, but I didn't know that they had given me the $5 coupon. So I'm going to let her, hopefully she can fit these. If she can, I'm going to let her wear this today with some black leggings and her birthday shirt. Let me show you guys our shirts that we'll be wearing today. She's knocked out on our bed. <laughs> anyway. These are the three shirts right here. Here's Ronnie's. Hold on. They're the same shirt. I just got his in black. So that's his. And then... This is hers, and I got her some special Mickey pink ears to wear today. And then she can wear those shoes with it if she can fit them. I got them a little big, so hopefully she can fit them, but they run small. And then this is mine. Me and her have the same color. So I'm going to grab her black leggings and then my black leggings. And I have to put some beads on her hair. And then we have to go to Wegmans to get the cupcakes, probably a fruit and veggie platter as well. And then, you guys... That's it. So let me grab what I need. Because as soon as she wakes up, I'm going to try to do the beads. I'm just going to do clear so my parents don't have to worry about her hair. And then I need to go through her bag. As you can see, I still need to pack. But that's okay. I can do that when we get back. Because all my stuff is clean. I just need to grab her black leggings, which I do not see. I thought they were in here. Those are her dresses for the week. Yeah, I don't know what... Oh, here they are. Is this it? I have no idea. Hold on. I also uploaded a new vlog. It hasn't went live yet because it's tripping. I don't know what's going on with it, but... I don't know where the black leggings are. Let me go find those. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So, the three of us, Marley's in the back, and so is Reagan, just left the post office. And Miss Carla, Auntie Carla sent Ray a birthday surprise. So, we're going to open it and see what it is. Yeah, I don't know. They're tripping about my P.O. box. They told me it didn't expire until August, so I was going to renew it today. I get there. There's someone else's mail in my P.O. box, and I have a notice saying it was due in may i'm like what so she looked in the system and said the box doesn't belong to anybody right now but they closed out my account so i have to call on monday and have them reopen it but i don't know why somebody else's mail was in there if it doesn't belong to anybody i don't know anyway we got miss carla's gifts oh she got her a book let's see it says I didn't realize it had a CD until after I bought it. Some people still own CD players, I guess. But anyways, the kids will enjoy the nursery rhymes when mommy and daddy read it to them even better. So this is cute. It has a CD on it, nursery rhymes. 
Ray wants her book, and it has Humpty Dumpty, so many other classic nursery rhymes. So thank you. Okay, thank you, Auntie Carla. She also got her some Minnie Mouse cards, counting in shapes. She needs these, so we'll be learning with those. And then she she buys her the cutest Minnie Mouse stuff, you guys. The cutest. Okay, look at this. She got her size four in this one. This is um pajamas, I think. Is it pajamas? Let me see. No, this is an outfit. It's so cute too. It's long sleeve. Look at this. And the pants are here. So cute. And then she got her some nightgowns. She labeled them for me, so I know they're nightgowns. Some Carter's nightgowns, which she always needs. She got her these in 2T, which is her size now, so that's great. And then she got her this rainbow one. So cute. And then she got her some Under Armour. This little, let me see what she got her. This little Under Armour outfit. What size is this one? 3T, so she'll be in this one in the fall, which is perfect. And then the matching pants to that are here. So cute, you guys. And then she got her this Minnie Mouse outfit in a size 2T, which is perfect. And I love the peplum bottom. Look at that, so cute. And then the sunflower pants. And these pants are thick too. Really good material quality leggings. So thank you so much, Auntie Carla. She also sent some cards. She sent us a wedding gift. Oh, thank you. She didn't have to do it. Girl, thank you so much. Um, congratulations on your marriage. Oh, she sent us a Cheesecake Factory gift card, guys. Congratulations on your marriage and best wishes. Love you always. So I have to show this to Ronnie. When we get back from vacation, we'll definitely be using this because we love the Cheesecake Factory, you guys. Thank you so much, Miss um, Carla. And then she sent Reagan a happy birthday card. Auntie Carla loves you all. Say thank you, Auntie Carla. Oh, did you guys hear her? She's playing with her book. You got a new book? Let's see. You got a look. Oh, a Minnie Mouse card. It says, It's your birthday. It's really true. Okay, hold on. Bye bye to one, hello to two. Happy birthday. Wow, Princess Reagan, where's the time going? Auntie Carla wants to wish you a fantastic birthday and year to come. Love you, Princess. Thank you so much, Carla. What do you want? This? She wants her card. Okay, don't rip that card because we're going to save it. Let me put this stuff back in the bag. Thank you so much, Auntie Carla. We appreciate it. This was a pleasant surprise before Ronnie and I leave to go on vacation. Baby girl needs fall wear. So I'm so blessed to be able to um, have supporters like you that help us out. And you guys know that she wears y'all's clothes. I try to send pictures or at least I'll text you or send you a DM whenever she wears your stuff. Um, but thank you guys so much. We really, really appreciate it. And you did not have to get Ronnie and I a wedding gift at all. But we will be using it because we love food. I love nightgowns for her. She looks so cute in them. So now she has two more. You need to open it. Ask Marley to help you open it. This is just too adorable. This shirt is so cute. I love it. Anyway, um, now we're headed to Chick-fil-A. Then we're going to go back home, shower, and head out to get the cupcakes at Wegmans and head to the party location. So we will check in with you guys later. Deuces. Ray, say deuces. She's reading her card, y'all. <laughs>